So my name is Dr. Maggie Adair in Pocock. Uh, I work as a rocket scientist for a company called Astrium Limited. The Big Bang is an amazing theory, but quite a complicated idea. And it all started with some observations made by a chap called Edwin Hubble. And here's the chap we need the Hubble Space Telescope after. Now, what Hubble did is he was trying to understand the size of the universe. He observed stars of a known brightness. They're called Cepheid variables. Now, when he did this, he noticed something very odd. Firstly, that some of these stars were far, far further away than we ever anticipated. And also he noticed their colours were slightly changed, shifted towards the red, something called redshift. So from Hubble's observations, we notice that everything seems to be moving away from us. The universe is effectively expanding. So as time goes on, the universe expands more and more. But let's say we reverse time and take time backwards. It means that if we go back in time, everything starts to coalesce and come together. And so this is how we came up with the theory of the Big Bang. The idea that the universe began with a, a cataclysmic explosion, which created space, time, and all the matter in the universe.